up guys i'm anna mckenna and you're a developer and welcome to my channel the devil chats if you're new here please like and subscribe to my channel because i post videos almost daily okay today this is kind of a different video where i will show you to uh, how to publish your game on each.io today i'm i was like i was going to publish one of my steam games that i released recently which i realized that i didn't upload it on each year yet so it would be really great if i can show you how to upload this upload your game on itch.io and sell it okay since it is available at uh, one dollar on steam i have to put the same pricing here so let us come to the screen okay see here this is the itch.io dashboard i'm showing for this game i'm going to publish ghost in the barnhouse game here Okay, which I had published a few months back on Steam and so I realized that it is not available on itch.io so I thought I would publish it right now. So first off, let us take a look at how things are going. Okay, uh, As you can see this is what I have done. Uh, I have uh, put the title and here is a short description which must be less than 200 characters. and. Uh, and it is a game obviously it's a game and if you're selling other physical goods game mods or game assets you can do that too here it's a nice platform it's downloadable uh yeah it's already released so i am putting release status no after that um as you can see the pricing here uh, what i have to do is in order to make it paid just uh, this is the suggested uh, revenue so if you put dollar zero here okay dollar zero donate that means people will be able to download your game for free but if they want they can donate like two dollar one dollar however they want okay even if your game is free you can earn money just from just from the tips given by some generous hearts and souls okay <laughs> anyway now um, uh, this is uh, the paid one and no payments if you can if you want it to be uh, available just for free and not, not and not accepting any kind of payments okay so let us put it paid and the minimum price is already given one dollar so i don't have to change and suggested price if you want to keep it so that people can donate extra two dollars for it i will say i will keep it okay if people would be interested anyway now as you can see uh, i've doubled the files i haven't done yet i'll show you step by step how to do it and these are the all uh, features and uh, that I have written here you can this is a really uh, easy to use okay There's the key features that I'm showing you right now I'll use the bolt and I can increase the size but I don't want to I want it to be like this okay um, this, this is how it looks now the next thing is here uh, let us go down I have to choose the genre first which genre it is it's obviously horror and uh, there's no other like i would choose adventure because it's a it's an adventure kind of game so uh it'd be okay now here you can put tags on steam you can put tags too so in on each year if you want people to like uh, find you easily you should put tags like uh you have to put maximum of 10 tags okay so i'll put 2d okay horror since a horror game a survival horror okay like this and then uh, uh, pixel graphics probably it's large uh, retro retro graphics and uh, what to do top down yeah top down top down adventure if you want I will keep both okay top down adventure uh, one two three six seven seven uh, I need more three uh, what's what's next to give probably this one mm. okay mm. no I can fight cartoony if there is no there is no cartoony colorful yes it's colorful and uh, kind of cool okay let's go with eight one and I will uh, I really can't recall anything that I can put here right now so okay uh, the next thing is uh, what you have to do is uh, it's already done if you want to make it bold you can do it like this now uh, one dollar price okay I have already uploaded uh, the trailer you just have to put the YouTube link 
here and it will it will be automatically get embedded into this page okay now for the cover I would go with uh, um, okay oh there's so many I'm sorry guys okay the question burn house this one data DRM free I will go to graphics section there's so many things here uh, which one I'd saved okay cover image I'll go with this one that should do it um, okay it's uploading okay yeah look good uh, now I'll add screenshots from here like uh, steam materials I always keep this organized okay in case like it is required you can hold everything like shift and click first you click the select this image and then you click like uh, press the shift key and then click here as to uh, like uh, selecting all of this and then upload it here and this is one of the best features uh, of Ichio okay steam on steam you have to like upload one image at a time yeah yeah you can upload uh, multiple nowadays but I, as i can recall the like there was a there was a system where you have to upload like one uh, one image at a time so it was really bad now they have fixed that though so anyway um, it's it's uh, it's done near it's not yet done but uh, i have to put the files so let us take a look how it looks okay it's not yet published it's it's currently in draft mode so it's not publicly visible okay so as you can see here it looks good this is how it looks huh and then um, what you have to do is uh, I have to <coughs> um, upload the files which I will do the uh, at the very last stage so let's design this page okay and there's an edit theme button at the top so which, which you can use and then here you go like I want the background to be black okay and two um, I have to make sure that uh, this looks bad though I can't see anything okay I've done this I have toned down this uh, whole thing like this okay now the text I will not make, make it really bright but uh, for instance if I do something like this not very bright not very so that it doesn't affect the eyes okay some colors are very like are very harmful for eyes okay so i have to make sure that it's eye friendly okay mm, this is how it looks uh, i think i'll go with this one yeah now the link color should be something like this one too yeah that should do it you can provide header colors and all you can change it but instead uh, I you can change the font too if you want uh, you can select Google fonts too like uh, or you can use pixel like this one this looks good for like uh, the old-school uh, graphic system so what you have to do is you have to go to here like select Google font and then uh, like okay let's take a look how this looks like preview I can preview it here okay not bad though probably I'll use it let me take a look and how it will wow it looks good yeah kind of it looks good probably I'll use it uh, and the color of text must be a bit brighter uh, okay like this uh, kind of look okay now now what you have to do is uh, you, the screenshots are automatically uh, placed here so uh, the next you can also customize it if you want if you want to customize it more you can contact uh, the owner of this platform each.io and they will arrange it for you okay if you want to use CSS and all the stuff HTML uh, okay so for the banner I already have created a banner for my game so there should be no problem sorry guys it's uh, it's really um, okay I think I've kept it in the graphics section this should be the banner 
the banner will be placed instead of that header okay like those uh, the title so it looks like this okay this looks good more or less uh, at least for me anyway it can be made better though so this is how it looks now you can align it, align it to the center so as it done now you can use background too if you want uh, I don't know if I should use the background here Maybe it might not look good but probably um, I'll do it uh, fixed instead yeah it doesn't look good though I can see the banner so if you want to remove it just click on remove image and th th that will do it okay so now you have to save it it's good enough now I have to add the files uh, let's go to edit game and here you can upload it for different platforms I am I am uploading the DRM free version that I've just uh, exported okay uh, now I, I will upload this one this is uh, the uh, I've uh, I placed it into a GIF file so it will be easier and look it's uploading oh it's done <laughs> um, my internet is super fast I guess it's only 13 MB so that's quite obvious so uh, the next thing is it's for Windows you can use this uh, checkboxes to determine uh, this which file belongs to the uh, which uh, operating system okay you can put it you can publish Android games too if you want as you can see here is an Android checkbox cool huh anyway the next one is Linux so I'd go with Linux edition here mm, okay let's take a look okay where did the file go oh my god oh, I guess I need to uh, sorry guys uh, I, I guess I have to change the uh, file here I'm sorry okay uh, I need to delete this file right now okay delete it let us uh, upload it like this okay uh, upload like this okay uh, and then okay it's already 12 minutes video sorry about that guys uh, there's nothing I can do about it because it's a bit long so be patient with me okay now the next thing is I will upload the Linux version Linux this will differentiate both the files. I think uh, this system couldn't differentiate between the two um, operating system. So the file name must be different. Okay. So I checked the Linux one and it's done. And uh, now you can see he here like for Windows, what you have to do is step one. I, this is what I typically do is uh, decompress uh, the GIF folder. okay step two double click on ghost in the burn house dot exe to run the game simple for Linux okay step one decompress the chip folder and then uh, step two double click on runner file to run the game uh, and then you can provide uh, if you encounter issues or something similar please contact me at mm, I guess I'm, I'm not going to write this okay for now let's go so uh, this is how you do you have provided the instruction instruction you need uh, for Windows you must install JTX 2.0 C in order to play the game okay done now let us take a look at how it looks 
Yeah, look, the binder button is now visible and the whole thing is done. It looks really good, I guess. And if now the ne next thing I can do is a theme, uh, you know, background color is okay. I can put the same background color here too. So, or <laughs> I can reduce the like, if I can do like this, that also looks good. And okay this looks kind of good or i can use this color like in order to um okay let me see let's see, take a look it's not uh no, it looks better like this i guess Okay. Mm. And make it as bright as you want or as uh, dark as you want. The by now button should be well visible. Like this. Okay. More or less, it looks okay. -ish. And this is how you make an ichio game and now what you have to do is save it then edit game now what you do is you have to check this box public and save and by that your game your game page will be live and there is no approval process or anything okay so if you are a hobbyist or anything like you if you're just starting out each is a really right place for you or if you want to like uh, target various other platforms uh, other than steam then it might be a great opportunity for you to get your game to some of the other section of the players so I hope this video is really helpful for, for you uh, if it is please like and subscribe to my channel because i post uh, for about daily right now like uh, it, I, i'm posting about like every single day i'm posting my videos on youtube so uh, i hope this is really helpful for you thanks for watching and see you again in the next video